What's up, disc golfers? So I went out for a winter disc golf match. I mean, the snow was just pouring down, but uh, we have a league match for our winter league coming up on Sunday. So a bunch of us went out to kind of get some practice in and have some fun on this beautiful snowy winter day. Uh, as you can see, all of our discs have lots of ribbons and things like that on them to help us find them a lot easier. So it makes a big difference, trust me, because it's super easy to lose them in the snow here. Starting off with par, I'm happy with that. And then I find that my throws don't seem to want to go as far in the winter, but that was a great approach. I was super pumped about that one. Save par for that. Oh, yeah. Now, this next hole is kind of like a Achilles heel for me. I don't know if I want to go too far, but... I really blew that one. I liked to end up in the middle, but ended up on the right. Man, it was really pretty outside there. So here we go again with an epic fail. Almost sent it to OB. Trying to get a little recovery shot here using the new Condor from Innova. I like that disc. I think it's kind of fun. If you haven't used it before, it's kind of like a toss disc, like in size, but it has a pretty good flight to it. And there we go. That uh, doesn't help my score at all. It gives me a plus two. My drives, like I said, don't seem to be wanting to go as far in the winter. I think it might be all the winter clothes that I'm wearing that's kind of slowing it down. Big Anheuser throw. Big fail. Potter gets me there. Wanted to save par, but that's kind of out the window now. Those chains are mute in the winter, man. Just covered. Everything is just... It, we got a lot of snow that night. We ended up playing a night game. Another round after this nine. It was a fun game. I was really hoping to get this one in for a highlight, but just missed it. Then I had to get through this bush. That branch was kind of right on my line. And then this ended up giving me another bogey, which I'm not thrilled about. Scores me up to plus four. As far as a practice round goes, I mean, if I get this score on the league night, I'll be very disappointed. <laughs> I think I'm going to end up probably scoring around, my goal is around plus eight for the league night. Uh, the best score I've had on this course for 18 is minus three. So a plus four for nine and then plus four for the back nine would be pretty good for me. I'd be pretty happy with that. Wasn't playing great this round. After this round, I obviously, when I, once I put the camera away, I was making some really good shots. We played a doubles match after that, and we were able to come ahead for that doubles match. But you do what you do when you can do it. But anyways, here we go. And uh, sending it down. This is kind of the go for the ace hole for me anyways. I always feel like this is one that I should be able to at least get close really disappointed with that miss there finishing off for a par i wanted to get a, a minus there for sure but it didn't happen for me and then i throw this one right into the bush at the beginning i started to really fall apart tried to throw a little forehand with the rock to get through the trees there worked out kind of nice would like to be closer obviously sends the putt can he make it no i can't couldn't save par but that's okay. Finishes off. I think I finished with a plus five. Subscribe if you want to see some more videos like this. Like I said, we have a big game coming up for the league. So hopefully I'll get a better score then. Check me out on Instagram if you want to see some more content there. And I will see you guys next time.